I just okay. What was that, Crystal? Um, I put my teacups up in the cabinet and then I shut the door and I guess they were out a little far, like they're too crammed in there and I shut it and it sounded like some of them broke. I don't want to look at it if they're broke. <laughs> Yeah. I'm not going to go look at it right now. Yeah. Yeah. You can cry later. I just will ignore it for now. <laughs> I don't want to clean it up now. Okay, first, we're going to talk a little about the recipe today because okay. there was a, re a request for some like background information. So, um, the two main, so we're going to make pakora, which is an Indian um, little patty made with. Um, chickpea flour and cauliflower and um, so cauliflower is so good for you in so many ways it has uh, four different types of antioxidants um, and they um, prevent cancer cells from growing um, they improve heart health and they also in this in a study because it's a cruciferous vegetable, which is like broccoli, cauliflower, um, cabbage, bok choy, um, vegetables like that. They did a study and, and people with um, liver problems, their liver enzymes were improved if these people ate these cruciferous vegetables, which cauliflower is one. It has a lot of fiber, so it's good for weight loss, and for um, you know maintaining your blood sugars, any any you know having having a lot of fiber in your diet is good for blood sugars. Um, and that same goes with um, uh, chickpeas. Uh, they have a lot of fiber and protein, so that's also good for your blood pressure or your blood sugars. And oh, actually, it is it's good for your blood pressure too. Anyways. Um, that's our little blurb about the recipe. Um, I think I, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to try to make um, the flour. We kind of talked about that you can make your own flour. So you're going to have to just bear with me because yeah. I'm going to try it out. Okay. Okay. I had, I bought my own flowers. Yeah, I that was. Some... That's a huge thing. Oh, Uncle Steve, you have a lot of food. Where, where did you get yours? I got the, got it at Fennings in St. Agatha. What's that? I got it at Fennings in St. Agatha. Oh. We had a lot of it. Okay. I, I had to go to the the town pantry at the, yeah. at the pharmacy there. Yeah. I would assume they would have it. Yeah. They've got a lot of stuff. Well, and we called it chickpea flour, but um, I think you had you have a package that says garbanzo bean flour, right? Yeah, yeah, garbanzo bean. Garbanzo bean. Yeah. Um, okay. I'm just gonna mute because the kids are playing loudly. Okay. Well, I can. I'm gonna mute in a second too because this is gonna be loud. Um, so I'm all I'm doing is. Can you see my um, thing? So all I'm doing is I'm putting the the blade in the uh, food processor and oh shoot and I'm gonna put a cup of chickpeas in. They're just right out of the package, dried, not cooked. And we're just going to put that on. Is that loud? A little bit. I'm going to mute. Okay. I think I'm the only one not muted. Hi, Noah. Hi. I will, I'll unmute for a minute there. 
put a movie on because so they're being quiet. <laughs> Funny how that happens with kids. You just put something on and they're quiet. We're already watching Christmas movies. Christmas. We're so excited. We're so excited for Christmas. I can't even tell you. Like, I have no idea why we just. Well, really you, missed, like, you missed last year quite a bit. Yeah, we were really sick. Yeah. So, which was not fun. Yeah. So, but we uh, like, we like, we like this. <laughs> Noah wants me to tell you that, yes, we were really sick. He even threw up. <laughs> Are you going to watch um, Elf? Well, we watched Elf the other day. Um, and we don't watch TV every day, but we're watching The Grinch, the 2018 one today. Oh, okay. So, there, that, it's actually, I like that one. It's pretty cool. Well, it's about time to watch Christmas anyway right now. It's getting there. It, it was cold yesterday and today this morning. Yeah. Well, they they will play, like, um, sidewalk chalk and we'll go for a walk, but it was actually cold. Like, yeah. we were cold. Yeah. yeah. Especially in the morning. Sorry. Mornings are, like, yeah. I think yesterday it was, like, two degrees or something. Yeah. It, it was pretty chilly. It warmed up a little bit, but I wouldn't say very much. But we really like snow, so we can't wait till it snows so we can play outside. <laughs> like, I yeah, think Noah likes playing outside in the too. winter and the summer. Yeah. I hate snow. <laughs> you hate. That's why you're in Mexico. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Well, I stopped that because I did it for two. It said to do it for two minutes, but it's still a lot. So um, I'll try it later and see if we can get the rest of it all chopped up, but it's still quite big. So, but for now, so let's make... What's they're that? dried chicken? Yep, yeah, just, just out of the just package, dried. just out, just like dried, like out of the package. Oh, cool, okay. Yeah, but we'll, I'll, I'll put it back on later and uh, see if we can get it, get it looking like it, like it was showed in the video. Okay, we can start our pecora. Okay, so have you guys already started your pecora? I, I put the, the I haven't started. Off. Oh. Okay. One second. All right. Well, I gotta start. I gotta find a bull. Am I still putting salt in as well? What's that? Am I still putting oh, yeah. salt in as well? No, is there, sorry, Steve, did I leave salt on the list? Oh, no, so you, yeah. sorry, normally I try to take salt off of the list, yeah. but no salt for you. No salt for me, but I just no. put everything else in. So. Yeah, I, you know, actually, I didn't even put salt in for us oh. when I made it. I'm putting salt in. Okay, you can put salt in, you're allowed. <laughs> okay. okay, so one cup of, oh, sorry, go ahead. Are you talking to me? Yeah, what were you saying? Oh, I don't think, I can't remember, but it didn't, it wasn't important, I don't think. Hey, Noah. Oh, sorry. Hey, Noah. Noah, look what I built. <gasps> what did you do? Oh my gosh, that's awesome. You need the, you need a little seat on top to put your little man. So we got to put in a uh, half a tea. So we got a cup of uh, chickpea flour, half a teaspoon of uh, ground corian, corian or cilantro, coriander. Ow. Um, all my spoons are. Let's see. You know what? I used this new purple shampoo the other day, and I feel like it fried my hair. I don't really? know what is going on. Yeah, like usually my hair is half decent, and then I used this purple shampoo, and now it's really dry. I don't know it why. Was, what was the name of the shampoo? It wasn't called purple shampoo, it was just purple, right? Well, I don't have blonde hair, so you buy like a purple, you can buy it from any brand. Oh. Um, so I buy, it. it's just like a tinted, from my understanding, it's just like a tinted shampoo. And it takes out the brassiness of the blonde. I haven't used them in a long time, but because I've gone so blonde, I wanted to try it again. Mm. I used it, and after my hair was really dry and it. So, such a stinker. It's 
So, um, we're putting in a uh, half a teaspoon of ground turmeric, um, half a teaspoon of chili powder, um, one teaspoon of garam masala, which is what we used. We used garam masala in that butter chicken. Yeah. And I really love it. And garam masala and two cloves of garlic minced. The one thing about turmeric too is that it's a anti-inflammatory, really good for your for your gut. And garlic is good for your heart. You know, last night I made um, roasted chickpeas. It's just, have you ever made it? Yeah. Well, I spice them too. Yeah. Yeah. Like well, I put, I put um, cumin and paprika and chili powder in it. And, and I was going to show it to you today, but we ate almost all of them. <laughs> and that's all that's left. <laughs> you only so left yummy. like six. Yeah. <laughs> so I think we should we should do um a video on on those because they're a really good first snack. They are. Speaking of, we should do like one day of snacks. We should. Well, we got you know next day. week is going to be um, the brownie. The brownie. Yeah, Steve wanted a no sugar brownie. Okay. And so we that's could do, we could also that's do. I, that's what I consider a snack. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But you might fall in love with these, um, these uh, roasted chickpeas. You know, with the roasted chickpea, you can put on your salad and it adds a nice crunch, a nice crunch. Oh, yeah. And it adds protein. For those of us that need extra protein. Yeah. Look at you and your information. Oh my goodness. I am impressed. <laughs> <laughs> well, I try to like research um, before, you know, before we make a, a recipe, I try to like get all the nutritional yeah. value and research. Yeah. The only thing about this recipe is that it's fried, but it's in olive oil. Oh. So I'm not totally against it. Okay. So do you guys have all of your um, your dry ingredients? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I just need to get my garlic. Okay. We'll wait for you. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna stir all my stuff together. It smells very Indian. Mm. Like an Indian restaurant. Like that. What's that? Yeah, it smells like an Indian restaurant. Oh, like it. yeah. Yeah, it does. Their food smells so good. Yeah. Mm, nice, nice. Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be awesome. It's right in here. Can you put this in the sink for me, please? Did Noah end up liking the butter chicken? The what, sorry? The, did Noah end up liking the butter chicken? Oh, yeah. Good. She, she, um, she, she wouldn't mind if I never made it again, but that's fine. She's a baby. Well, she's yeah. too. He really liked it. Good. Well, it's hard for kids, right? Yeah, like she's never had anything like that. Like Noah's had Chinese food, Mexican food, you know, Italian food, um, Greek food. So he's already been exposed to a lot. She's still behind because she's only two and a bit. So. 
Right. Right. We'll get her there. She likes pizza. That's Italian, right? <laughs> she likes pizza. <laughs> okay. Actually, before we add the water, you guys haven't added the water yet, have you? No. Okay. Let's let's do the. Um, I actually haven't been reading the instructions. Um, so let's let's chop up the um, cauliflower before we add the water. Mine is kind of small. We do the we do the whole cauliflower. Uh, yep. You can if you want less, you can do less. But I like the whole cauliflower. Depends how big it is too. Like if it's ginormous, maybe not. Oh, there's a dog on top of it. It's okay. I'll be right back. Okay. Well, you don't, you're not going to put it in the blender. We're just going to cut it. Um, no, cut first, cut it into one inch pieces. And then we're going to put it in the food processor okay. and, uh, and then chop it up into like smaller, um, you know, pretty small pieces. I'll show you. Okay. Um, they get there. Right now I'm just chopping mine up. Sorry, they were about to get into a huge disagreement. I mean, they did get into a huge <laughs> They're pretty, That's pretty quiet for a huge disagreement. I, I, Laura, I muted the... <laughs> oh, you did? Oh. <laughs> okay. So yeah, it would have been pretty quiet for you. <laughs> Actually, they're, they're not too loud. It's just um, Eve is going through a, a phase of like throwing toys occasionally and, and hitting. Mm. And so, yeah, so we're just working on that. It's hard for Noah to understand because he's only, only five. Or... Yeah, that's hard. Yeah. So how are we cutting the cauliflower? It says dice, does it? Yeah, dice. Yeah, so dice. if what you don't have mean? a, you are not using a, um, a food processor, right? No, I don't okay, know. So, I could. Okay, if you have one, I would use, that's what I use. Um, I would just use my Vitamix. It, it can okay. do that. Kind of thing. Okay. So it's not, you're not chopping it up to, like you would have pieces like about this size. And then you put it in the food processor? No, I, no, I cut it into like one inch pieces. Okay. About like this size. Yeah. And then I put it in the food processor and then just, you know, do on pulse and get them small, you know. You can okay, even just, you don't even have to cut it really. You can just break it up. I'll try and it. I don't put in, I put like maybe a quarter of the cauliflower in at a time so that it's not like overwhelming the food processor. Uncle Steve, do you have a food processor? What's that? Do you have a food processor? How are you doing yours? Yeah, it's, it's mom's food processor that she didn't even know she had. <laughs> so she won't miss it. Yeah. You won't miss it. There you go. We have to be careful because we're recording here. Yeah. <laughs> and now she knows she has it. <laughs> ah. Um, okay, I'm gonna try it in the Vitamix. It okay. Work. Yeah, I don't really know. I don't have. I don't know. Show me your Vitamix. So it's technically, it's they they have a separate attachment that is a food processor, but this should chop it. Like I would just keep an eye on it. This is usually for smoothies, though. Oh, okay, okay. Well, that should work. 
There's breadcrumbs all over it because it's, oh, it's underneath the toaster. Ew. <laughs> I've been wanting to get a juicer lately. I was looking at like some really good brands. They're pretty expensive though. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, um, we thought about getting one because we wanted to do um, the green beet, do the beet juice. Give it. Yeah. Because we're big fans of beets, so we wanted to yeah. do beet juice. That's good. So, you know, because they they did a study with athletes that drank beet juice every day. And it improved their performance because beets open up your your uh, capillaries, your your arteries, and they let the blood flow through. And uh, so wow. we wanted to do that, but we just haven't gotten around to it. That's really cool. Now, if you're ready to be obedient, you can walk time now. Eve, you come here. <laughs> Eve, you come here. Is that too small? Let's see. I think it's fairly. Can you put it, bring it up? Yeah, it looks pretty small. Let me see. It's hard to see in your camera. I think that's so. Yeah. Well, bring, pull a piece out. That's, okay. This is one of the bigger pieces. Okay. That's pretty big. Oh, is it? So if they're small, if they're smaller than that, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Oh, let me see if I can get mine out. Here's Steve, can you see this? Yeah. Okay, that's about what mine. Yours might be a little bit overall better. Like okay. bigger. Oh, no. Many blues fell. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm gonna mute you guys because this bite the Vitamix is like notoriously loud. So I can Okay. Are we gonna add the water now? Um, yeah, if you want to. I'm I'm still mixing my or getting chopping up my cauliflower, but if you want to, so you have to make a little well in the middle. Yeah, and then just so, start and then just it? yep, and then you do you have um whatever this is? Oh, <laughs> uh, I don't uh, know if I got one of those. A whisk. Well, you oh. can use it. You can use a fork. You don't need a whisk, but a whisk <laughs> I like. Okay. Maybe I'll get one. I think it smells like Pecora just putting the water in. Yeah, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I love it. I love that. Because um, I can smell when I go to the, the Indian restaurant. Yeah, and you know, our Pecora that we made last time didn't have that that lovely smell. You add the cauliflower to the dry ingredients right away? 
no, no. You have to add the water first, the water first and you make it kind of into like a little dough. Like a little dough. Okay. And then mm -hmm. we add it. Okay. So I'm adding my water. I don't know if you can see. Yeah. And then stirring it. So it should be fairly thick, like a nice consistency. So mine's pretty thick. Okay. Yeah, mine's not too bad. If it's too thick, you can always add water to it. Yeah. Now we put the cauliflower in it. Yep. You can just throw it all in and then um, mix it together. Now, what you could do is just start with half of the cauliflower Too and late. then, okay, well, <laughs> okay. Well, there's one big chunk. There's one what? One big chunk. Oh, yeah. I just, I just eat those. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there's, yeah, I got a couple too. Did you guys do the garlic yet? Yep. Yeah. The garlic's the garlic. You did the garlic already? Yeah, it goes in the dry ingredients. Okay, okay. So what part are you at? Frying? We have, um, no, we're just putting the dough in with okay. mixing it up with the cauliflower. Okay, I have to mix my gar mince my garlic yet and then I'll... How does yours look, Steve? Uh, not too bad. Can you see it? Mm -hmm. That looks good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Looks like mine. Can we put a quarter cup of olive oil in there? Well, you don't have to. You can put, like, like you start out with, like, two tablespoons and then cook some and then see if you need to add more. Yeah. So now we're going to divide the pakora into little patties and just put them in the frying pan yeah i'm gonna make all my patties because i like to divide it up into eight so i'm gonna like take half of the pakora well so you put them on a plate or something yeah i have a pan here that i'm gonna put on holy Thank you. 
So basically, you're going to. Squish them together, try to make them into a pack. I think maybe one head of cauliflower is a little too much for the batter because mine's having a hard time staying together. But you just keep squishing it. Is your sticking to together, Steve? Um, um, it takes a bit to get them together. No, yeah. Like that. The other one I did last time. I did only three quarter of the of the head of cauliflower, and they worked out a little, a little better. Yeah. yeah. It's like she doesn't want you to cheat her, okay? We both have things we don't like. Christmas tree. Holy. Are we going to get one that big? Time we'll add more of the dough. Like we'll we could do like a cup and a quarter, you know, of the um, chickpea flour because mine's pretty crumbly. More water. And a, yeah, like I would like next time we make it, or if you want to do it now, you could add like you could. I haven't even mixed my stuff yet. Okay. Well, if you want to, you could add like a quarter cup of flour and a little extra water, and then maybe yours won't be as crumbly as ours. Okay. Let me. I'll do a little bit of water. And then we'll see how yours turn out. That is pretty tough to me. Um, with just the cup, half a cup.
need a coffee. Holy. Oh, <laughs> you went to Tim Hortons? Tim Hortons. Yeah, I actually ran out of coffee grounds, like a bag of coffee grounds. Right. And so I right. was like, I naturally I panicked. I was like, what am I going to do? <laughs> yeah. No. So I've got nine I've got little nine patties, patties, but I've got some like got some crumbs, like crumbs of, um, of um, cauliflower in my cauliflower bowl. In my so bowl. I'm going to mix up so a little more, up a little more of, the batter. of the batter. So Aunt Laura, are you forming them? Just You're just pre-forming them before you put them in the frying pan? Is that what you're yeah. doing? Yeah. Yeah. See, okay. yeah. Um, Crystal? Crystal? Yeah. So I've just squished well, them into patties, patties, kind of flat kind of patties, flat patties. Uh, you know, maybe okay. you know, three quarters of an inch. Of an inch. Um, I put them on here so that I could, so that I, could I could use like a, like a, a spatula, spatula to lift them yeah, up and then, you can just, and then put them in. I got 19 patties. You got 19 oh. patties. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, you, well, you, well, you have small, well, let me see your patties. Okay. Okay. Can you, Can you flatten them down a little? Them down a little? Um, maybe when I put them on the frying pan. pan. Yeah, yeah, then yeah, yeah put them yeah, on the frying yeah, pan and then like and then squish them like, with your spatula. Well, maybe they'll be good as bowls instead of puffs. Yeah, I'm just worried about them not getting cooked all the way through. Oh, okay. Um, what did we put this on? Um, yep, medium. Uh, yep, medium. Medium high. Medium high. Depends on Depends how. Like, on I think you could do like, like a three or a like four, three or four on four yours. On yours. All right. This is actually a pretty easy recipe. It is actually. It is actually. Like, really manageable. And you could maybe pre mix it even. I don't know how long it would sit in the fridge, but. Yeah, like if you, you can pre-mix just all the dry ingredients and keep them in the, in the cupboard. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now I'm frying it, am I? Yeah. Yep. So put some olive oil in the pan, in the frying pan, and uh, put your little patties in. How did your patties turn out, Crystal? Really good. Okay, so I had a smaller head of cauliflower than oh, yours. Yeah, it was yes. organic, so they don't grow as big. Oh, oh. So it's nice and like it's 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 holding form, and it's oh. pretty oh. it's pretty good if you can see. Let me see. Oh. Like Let me see. oh, yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. yours turned out good. Yeah. I'm just making a little bit more of the. The dough. The dough. Look what I grabbed instead of extra virgin yeah. olive oil. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't want to fry that. There's barely any in there. Yeah. What? Sorry, I called it a spatula. Yeah, I called it a spatula do you call this a spatula? Like I a called spatula? it a spatula, but spatula? it's not oh, really. It's not really. It's not. I like spatula. No, what time is it? What time is it? Um, 11 13. Good job. Oh. So, uh, so me adding that, adding that, that batter that looks a lot better. Looks a lot better. It's 
What was that? What time is it? 11.13. 11.13? Yes. So can you tell the time already? I taught him how the other day, and he hasn't forgotten. So I've just been quizzing him every once in a while. Oh. Yeah. We talked about it on Wednesday, so I just keep asking him to see if he actually remembers. And he does, so. Good. <laughs> hey, Chris, Crystal. I, I taught yeah. Laura how to spell. You... <laughs> you taught Laura to spell? Aunt Laura to spell? Like bad oh, words? She, she's, yeah, she's not very good at spelling. <laughs> yeah, but what did you teach me to spell? Hot. And... This is before. This was before. Hot? What's that? Hot. You taught her how to spell. spell. Yeah. Mom's, mom and oh with, yeah. Um, with lipstick. Yeah. <laughs> I wrote hot everywhere with her lipstick. <laughs> it was fun, you know. Kids. Hot. But you know, it's Steve is to blame. He's the one that taught me. Hot. You wrote hot with lipstick. That's a little funny, actually. Uh -oh. <laughs> Okay. Have you started frying yours, Steve? Yeah. You have to yeah. You put them at all? Yep, you do. So fry them for how how long have they been on your frying pan? Uh, probably a couple minutes. Okay. Yep. Flip them after about three minutes. You can tell like they'll be kind of golden on the bottom. Like that photo. Did you see the photo? Uh, probably. It was on WhatsApp. Do you need more olive oil? <laughs> Kentucky straight bourbon. <laughs> I got a feeling mine. <laughs> I got a feeling mine are gonna be pretty crumbly. Are they? Yeah. But they'll Might taste. See, they'll taste fine. Yeah, see mine now. Like I added more batter, and now they they hold together good. Yeah, mine are doing no, my, really good. So I guess it's more water. I only added more water. Oh, you only added more. Oh, but you had a yeah. smaller cauliflower too. Yeah. So I guess that's the trick. Just just add a little more batter. Yeah, or water. I, I probably uh, had too much. I probably had a too too much cauliflower. Yeah, I think I think that's you and I both, Steve. Yeah. My cauliflower was pretty big too. So what do you normally eat with this? Like, is it traditionally eaten with something? I don't know. Um, like I told Steve the other day he could eat it with um, his the butter chicken we made. Yeah. You know, oh. in, instead of, remember we made the rice, yeah. um, the cauliflower rice? He did. He did. This would be a nice substitute. Mm-hmm. I tried making these when I when I made them this week, um, but baking just doesn't do it because it doesn't it, they don't hold together when you bake them, and the frying really it, the frying kind of seals the the bottom, and then you can flip them and it's all. That's what we're having for lunch. What do you eat them with, Steve? Because you. Well, I usually get, like, it's part of the main. Because you get a little bit of butter chicken, you get some rice, you get some other mm -hmm. stuff, and then you have pakora with it. It's kind, of, it's kind of a little snack with the main meal. Right. Okay. Oh. So each of these, each of these pakora, there should be about six carbs. Okay. Okay. Um, and that's digestible carbs, you know, like where you, you take the total carbs and then you subtract the fiber. Oh my gosh, they're good. Yeah, oh, you're oh already gosh. eating? Oh, sure I am. Yeah, it's really good. 
Because I tried two already. Mm -hmm. Can I take one? Yeah, just give me a second. Mm -hmm. I might leave these. Mm -hmm. I might leave these ones on a little longer. They remind me of crab cakes, sort of. Oh, yeah. You know what I really like is the texture. You can like the crunchiness of the cauliflower. I'm just flipping my first batch. So I only used a little bit of olive oil, but um, you know, maybe a tablespoon or so. And, but you probably need to add a little bit when you do your next batch. Did you use all of the olive oil, Steve? No, oh, because I just used half of what I did. Yeah. Because I got two, I basically got two batches. Right. Put the other half in now. I'm gonna brush out my damaged hair. I'm going to multitask with my damage hair. And on top of that, I don't know if I can find it for you guys, but I was, so I decided to curl my hair yesterday. And look, I found this piece that's like, where is it? I found this piece and it's like, short. It's like this long. And I'm like, when did that happen? Like one piece. What's, what's oh, Noah been up to? Somebody like, pulled my you hair go. out. <laughs> Oh, oh, I love, I love, I love them too. I love them too. Want to say hi? Want to say hi? Hey, Uncle Leon. Hello. How are you? How are you? Good. How are you? Hey, Steve. Are you at the gym? What's that? What's that? Were you at the gym? Yeah. 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 Well, it's earlier it's there, right? It's like almost ten thirty. Yeah. 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 We're an hour behind we're you. An hour behind you. Mm -hmm. Got Timmy's. Got Timmy's. You got what? Timmy's. Timmy's. Jimmy's coffee. Oh, coffee. Oh, coffee. Tim Hortons. Tim Hortons. Yes, I do. <laughs> oh, Is that Noah? Sorry, Is that Noah? Yeah. Come here. Uncle Neil. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. It's Uncle Neil. There you go. Hello. Hi. 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 How are you? How are you? How are you? Can we go to their house? They live really far away. So we can. Oh, he wants to come over. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just a little walk, you know. Yeah, just yeah. get in an airplane. Get in an airplane. Oh, he and will you can fly right here. Out. Fly here. Fly really, really quickly. Really quickly. Yeah. I'll hold on really, really tight then. Yeah. Why don't you? Why don't you get in your airplane, Neil? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sick of airplanes. Airplane. <laughs> okay. So are you, you going to come and visit someday? 
Yeah. Yeah. Where, where yeah. Did it come to? Yay. We're going to have a lot of fun when you do. Yeah. I'm going to I'm going to teach you some Spanish words. Yeah. Yeah. Good ones. Not bad. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> I think their crystal food is burning. <laughs> Steve, you're not supposed to be eating. You're supposed to be cooking. I did. I've done one, one frying, one thing full. So oh, wow. Okay. So I got Great. one part just half done. Then I'm done. Cool. Those look chunkier than last time. Oh. All right. Well, you guys have fun. I'm going to have a shower. Okay. Bye. 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 I need some salt on it. Mind you? No. Okay. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Second. <gasps> Kitty! Maya wants oh. to say hi. Hi, Kitty. Hello. I like her nose. Yeah, I like her color yeah. on her nose. Mm hmm No. It's a kitty. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh Kitty, yeah. Look at the thing. Hello, Kitty. <laughs> <laughs> hey Laura, uh -huh. how, did, how did you reheat them? Like, let's say I put them in the fridge tomorrow or for tomorrow and want to eat one. I just put them in the microwave. Okay, put it on low low power. Or? Uh, well, I don't. No, I put it on a regular, just thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. Okay. Yep, on high. So, yeah, it just warm, just warms them up. Yeah. I actually froze one. And so I'll thaw it out and uh, put it in the microwave, or I'll put it in the microwave and see how it how it does. You guys, I know Lindsay can't, Lindsay can't be in be here because her video doesn't work because she lives like in the wilderness. But look, do you see this picture of Aria? Can you oh, see? Let it? me see. Hang on. Oh, let me see. Hang on. She climbed up this this pile of arbor oh. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> wow and she wow. like that's fallen down trees she's she adventure girl adventure girl yeah do you know what she did when she was here last what? she i have shelves in noah's room like they're they're ledges for technically for photos but i right. put his books on them so they're the like the depth of them is very shallow well she wanted something on like the fourth shelf, which is the highest up. And so she climbed it and they fell out of the wall. All of them. <gasps> oh I like gosh. ripped the wall apart. Does she get hurt? Does she get hurt? No, she didn't, which was my biggest concern because it sound it was really loud. Because like oh, four yeah. large shelves falling too. No, she hid in the closet because she was scared. Aww. That she was in <laughs> And she was a little bit in trouble, but she didn't know the shelves were, like, the shelves were not, um, I don't know, they weren't in the wall firmly enough. Yeah, not rated for children. for children. Yeah, no. Yeah. And those kids like to climb, so. Oh, and those kids like to climb. No, I may join us when you're ready to be obedient. Okay, here's the, here's the, well, I only had well, half a pecora left a from the last, because Neil kept on eating them. So this one's frozen. This one's frozen. On the, 
and I'm going to put it in the microwave, microwave and see how, see how it does. It's frozen? Yes. See? Yes. Wow. So yeah. that's all that was left because you kept eating it. You kept eating it. <laughs> Freezer. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. I put the I one, put the frozen one, frozen in, one in for 30 seconds. Oh, 30 I'm just going to turn it over. Turn it over. See how it is. See how it is. Yeah. Yeah. So it's thawed now. I'm just going to put it in another 30. Another 30. Well, maybe 20. Well, maybe 20. Did yours all stay together, all Steve? Stay together, Steve? Um, uh, a little bit colder, but I'll be a little bit less closer, maybe. A, a little less what? A little less what? Well, I think I'm going to change the um, the recipe and add more batter to it, so you can use up. Because why not use your whole cauliflower? Okay. Yeah. You no, know, because then you you just have extra. You know, so I'll I'll change the recipe for, before I send it. I'll send and I'll resend it to you. Okay. So this is the one from last week. From last week. And I put it in for thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. And then I turned it over. I put it in for twenty seconds. It's pretty. You can see it's steaming hot right now. Hot right now. But. I'll let it cool. Maybe thirty seconds. Flip. Maybe twenty seconds. Flip it. Then twenty seconds. Um, Remember those other ones? Were kind of. After we put them in the microwave, they were kind of. Gross. Gross. Yeah. Yeah. They were. Yeah. yeah these ones microwave a lot better than the, our first batch. So this will be good because it's almost lunchtime. Yeah. I have some butter chicken in the fridge. Oh. Oh. Actually, I do too. I do too. Oh, we do too. Mm -hmm. Good idea. I'm getting it. Oh, you have some too? I got some. I think it's, I wonder how long this keeps though because it's been in there for like two weeks. Because mm -hmm. mine, I froze mine. I froze mine. I didn't freeze mine. No. And then I thawed it out. Thawed so it now out. it's in the fridge. So now it's in the fridge. Mm. Oh, no. It's just good. It's good. It's good. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm. Yeah. 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 Yes, Noah. Yes, Noah. Um, is that frozen ice? Yeah. No, it was oh, the frozen no, pecora. pecora. Okay, so here's the pecora. Okay, so here's the pecora. This is the one that was frozen. The one that was frozen. Mm -hmm. mm. It still tastes really good. Tastes really good. Mm -hmm. good. Can you make on here? 
Hey Laura. Uh huh. Uh -huh. You know, with, with this cooking thing, with videotaping it, yep. you should have another crew that comes and cleans up. <laughs> and then we videotape them and mock them. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Suckers. Oh, I can tape Neil because he cleans up. <laughs> oh, does he? Oh. Yeah, he does. He's in charge of cleanup. <laughs> You need to invite mom over. Yeah. <laughs> then she'll stay. Oh, oh, uh oh. <laughs> there. There. So these last ones, these last ones, they stay together a lot better. I added um, a quarter cup of the batter. So I'm gonna I'm gonna change the recipe. Okay. Because that'll be a lot. Be because a lot. Cause mine, because mine, mine one, 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 one just crumbled. crumbled. Right. Right. Yeah. So I'm going to try making the flour after, after the video. And then um, if it works out, I'll show, I'll show you the results next week. How are, are yours going, Chris? What was that? What was that? Are we kind of done now, or what? I know it's Crystal. Are you done, Crystal? Are you done, Crystal? I'm just frying them. Okay. I'm almost done. All right. Well, this, is, this is our second episode of two siblings and a niece. <laughs> Yeah, but the niece did shop wow. last week. Though. Yeah, yeah, just too simple. <laughs> it's very sad last week. Yeah, well, I was sick. I'm so sorry. I'll try to be here for filming every time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You bring you bring the uh, fashion component, the, uh, oh, the you yeah. know the hair styling and the in the products. I don't know. Don't use this product. <laughs> don't use. Well, don't use the one I used at least. Yeah. She might start a, she might start a side YouTube thing. Yeah. Yeah. She'll upstage us. I don't think I have time. <laughs> um, so next week we'll do um, the brownies and we'll also do the roasted um, uh, chickpeas. Okay. Oh, good. Okay. I'm going to start. Both of them next week? Both of them? Yeah, both of them. I think so because the brownies won't take too long. And the chickpeas okay. really are easy peasy. Yeah. So easy yeah. Cheesy peasy. Easy peasy chick peasy. Easy. <laughs> All right. Okay, I'm gonna stop recording.